So the simplest way to think of aging is the cumulative damage to our molecules and cells over time, right? That's what happens during aging, we talked about it. And all of these, they continue until we eventually die. So let's not pretend we can live forever, first of all. So the word longevity is very misleading. None of us are gonna live forever. We're all headed for the cliff. Imagine you're sitting in a car, you're headed towards a cliff, you know you're gonna die. But maybe we can slow the car down. The epigenetic modifications are the ones that are affected by your lifestyle. Hence, the UK study that shows with simple lifestyle modifications, you can significantly change the transcription of your mRNA and your proteins and can prevent damage to the proteins as well as the DNA. If you look at epigenetics, look at it as a book. You're not changing the words and pages of the books, but you, put the, you can put sticky notes on there. And based on the sticky notes, you decide which part you're gonna read again. And that's how you have to understand epigenetics. So in other words, it's the key to what happens to your cell based on whatever that is you're eating, you're doing, and you're breathing.